this is Mari Lane from the Buying Space channel. Today I'm continuing things uh, that I've resourced for free from Facebook Marketplace. Uh, one of the places I went, it was the end of the yard sale and they put their stuff on the curb. And I went and I picked up uh, their glassware and some books. And the gentleman came out and said, uh, would you like some wedding stuff? And I said, sure, why not? My daughter's 26, you never know. Of course, you know, my daughter's not ready to get married, but um, I just flew out of my mouth. But we have uh, the bridal bouquet. And we have lots of uh, little wedding decorations. Now, I, this is by all means not all of it. Um, a majority of it is in my car because I've decided to, um, there's the boutonniere, to go ahead and redecorate my mom's porch. Her house is white with blue trim. I think the bride did these herself. I really do. And um, the stuff on our porch has been out there for eon and a day. And uh, I got three baskets like this. Uh, my brother recently gave me some New Yorker magazines. And I've got some current Better Homes and Gardens. Uh, I think the books and stuff on Mom's porch are years old. And uh, with the uh, continuing COVID issues, I think that we could have... Uh, she already has furniture on the porch, and I don't know why we haven't done it yet. But, uh, and oh, the uh, ring pillow that we can make. See, it's brand new, $29.99, probably used once. Um, that we could have company come and meet on the porch with open air because she's got a screen in porch. Uh, beautiful angel plate. Again, all of this was free and the uh, amount of glass was three times this amount now this tray is plastic it's perfect for the porch serving on the porch because it's um, it looks pretty but it's plastic and it won't break on the top now I'm not sure what this piece is it says hodl glass bake and it has PAT for patent, and it has, I believe that's the number nine at the top. And this piece looks like it sat in something and had a special cork on the top. Uh, it might have been a restaurant piece. And uh, the bride had this, and um, also sh they had all the little boutonnieres and all uh, five bags of loose leaf uh, flowers blue petal and silver and green petal uh, flowers. I've got five bags of it and then boutonnieres. More boutonnieres. And then um, two metal tins. Like those big uh, tin tubs you feed cattle out of. They have the de decoration version of them. They're the small square ones. And I've got one full of flowers and one full of bubble blower favors for a wedding. And then another uh, oval tub with flowers in it so and all the streamers the net streamers for the seats yeah we're gonna do mom's porch up right and this can be used for a catch-all uh, I'm sure this used to have a lid this is glass it's Avon I'll comp it if it's not worth too much it'll go on the porch it's uh, hopefully it won't get broken but it's not an ashtray, but if you have somebody stop by that, you know, once it needs an ashtray, that's good. Or people can plop their keys in it, or we could put candy in it, or a snack. You know, of course, not all at the same time. It would have to be clean in between. Now, this is a collector's item. It's probably hard to see because it's white. And these came in all kinds of different colors. And this is. Oh, it's, haven't cleaned it really well yet. Hold on a second. Let me see if I can get that dirt off. <laughs> well, I got dirt part of it and a crack on it, but uh, it's a Kool-Aid. 
It's a vintage Kool-Aid cup for a kid. Cheers. And then we have this beautiful little white glass. Oh, and I, I kept some other little white dishes. I put them on top of the refrigerator already. They um, were, um, they go with some Frank Lloyd Wright uh, coffee mugs I have. And this is a little vintage basket. I think it says Wilson on the bottom, 1983. So this looks handcrafted, little cute little yellow basket. And then my daughter fell in love with these, so we are keeping these. These still need a little bit more washing. I, I rinsed them off with just uh, water and used my hands to get the dust off of them. They were pretty nasty. But there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And the uh, dissonance, as, as well as the dishes, were free. And then, I love this. I was like, oh my goodness, this is wonderful. Uh, and I found this, and holidays are coming up. And this was just wonderful until I got to a certain point and realized something. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave you with uh, this nativity set. And you can write in the comments below why I went from very happy to very like, oh. <laughs> So anyway, oh, Let's see gold, frankincense, and myrrh is how I'm going to do that. I'm not sure if this is Mary or an angel. She's wearing a cloak. She doesn't have wings, and she's got a lamb around her. She might be Mary. This is definitely Joseph. And of course, you put, kind of put the. Uh, the cattle uh, in the background. So, can anybody tell me what's wrong with this picture? But again, it was lovely. It was all free. There was much more of it than this. Uh, most of it's in the car that I'm going to decorate my mom's porch with. And I was very, very happy with all of it. I mean, can't be free. <laughs> if you like my videos, hit the thumbs up. Subscribe. And on the bell, if you click the bell, you can click all on there. It'll give you options on that. And if you click all, you'll see all the stuff that I'm able to resource for free. You can see how I recycle and reuse. And... Um, how I buy stuff from auction and lastly but very not leastly I do Bible readings and you can hear all my Bible readings so have a wonderful day again I'm just so excited I can't be quiet